There is another dimension, the Astral Plane. It is ruled by the evil tyrant Gargos. Long ago, the other astral beings resisted this Shadow Lord, but he slew them all and stole their powers. Good creatures known as Guardians fled from Gargos and his minions, escaping to other dimensions. And they sealed the astral plane behind them so that the corruption of Gargos could never taint another world. Until the sorcerer Khan Ra reopened that door, manipulated by Gargos' powerful mind control. Now Gargos is invading the Earth with his army of duplicate fighters called Mimics. This twisted demigod must be stopped, or he will enslave the human race forever. Meanwhile, in San Francisco's Chinatown, the Kung Fu master Kim Wu has inherited one of the last free astral beings, the Dragon Spirit, and Gargos will stop at nothing to take it from her. The warrior monk Jago is no stranger to the treacheries of Gargos. He comes from an alliance of Killer Instinct and Ultratech fighters, and he asks Kim to join their war against the merciless Shadow Lord. An astral portal opens, spewing forth a demon of Gargos, sent to eliminate Kim Wu and Jago. Mysterious power draws Jago to the portal. He enters and then vanishes. Arriving in the astral plane, he is dropped at the feet of Gargos. Why do you aid these pitiful earth beings, Jago? It is time for you to join your brothers by my side, and together we can rule this universe for eternity. But Jago will never again bow to the hated Gargos. Good up! Good up! Good up! Good up! 
Jago thinks he has defeated his nemesis, but he was tricked. Garkos was merely toying with him. The Shadow Lord reveals his new and even more powerful self. Jago summons all of his remaining shadow energy for a final desperate attack. But the Shadow Lord is too powerful, and Jago is blasted through the portal, scattering shadow energy across the globe. A mimic Kim Wu has emerged from the portal along with Jago. Kim must destroy her copied self or die. Kim has defeated her mimic, and it drops astral items. The nefarious sorcerer Khan Ra, a wielder of ancient magics, he tells Kim that the Killer Instinct fighters need her help to build a weapon capable of defeating Gargos. Khan Ra teleports Kim and Jago to his lair, avoiding the wrath of Gargos, for now. Welcome, Miss Wu. I have brought you to my Emporium out of necessity. Jago is dying. Give me the items dropped by the Mimic, and I will give you a relic to heal him. Quickly, there is no more time. Jago's spirit is almost gone. Come to make a deal. It slices, it dices. Just kidding.
afraid your path ends here. Supreme victory! Fight on! I've got a friggin' dragon! You can see how this ends, right? You should have tried. Supreme victory!
afraid your path ends here. Supreme victory! Argos draws his godlike power from the astral plane, but outside of his own realm, he is mortal. The spread of corruption transforms the Earth to feed Gargos' power. As this corruption spreads, so does the Shadow Lord's power increase. His army of omens guards the portals that feed his power to the Earth. They are honored to bear a portion of his glorious might to this new domain.